So speaking of cold weather, area homeless shelters are super busy now due to that front. But it's nothing that they can't handle. Action 10's John Rapolo is live from the Good Samaritan Rescue Mission on Alameda. Hi, John. What's going on? Yeah, good evening, guys. You know, the Good Samaritan Rescue Mission behind me is filled tonight. The cold, the wind, the rains taking its toll on the city's needy. We went on a ride tonight with homeless advocates. This is what we do during the winter, mostly only during the winter, when we know that people can't get to us. We arrive at a closed business near I-37. It's cold, it's rainy. The CEO of the Good Samaritan Rescue Mission is trying to get the needy off the streets. I got a shelter right up the road. Get you into a bed for the night. It's Good Samaritan. They say no, but they're offered food and something else. You need a blanket? Several homeless have their own reasons for staying outside tonight. Situation and then it's, it's going to get better for me. Though. Back at the Good Samaritan, the needy are pouring in. And we're prepared for it. Extra space and extra cots. About 250 are here. That's about 100 more than they usually see. Those pouring in have different faces, but similar stories. I had everything and lost it all. The homeless know what this time of the year can bring. It can be difficult and it can be dangerous. And through the night, this scene will be played out over and over again. The outreach will continue. It's cold. It's raining. People down here aren't used to this. Well, there you go. All right. The Good Samaritan Rescue Mission, you know what they need. They need blankets. They need clothing. They need food. They need coats, even cash donations. And I checked in with the city's two other overnight shelters, Mission 911, the Salvation Army. Yeah, you guessed it. They're filled to capacity as well. We're live in downtown Corpus Christi, John Rapolo, Action 10 News.